Hello everybody, I'm Jimmy the Saint, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die. This is Alpha 16. Alright guys, made it back out of the building. The sun is about to come up, but I thought I'd, you know, I'd risk coming out of here in the day... Quite, well, not quite daylight. Let me get the words out of the mouth. <laughs> um, the sun will be up really soon, so I thought I would chance it. And if we do run into a zombie, I've got a beer on the hot bar ready to go. I do have my pistol ready too, so we run into a zombie before daylight. But what I got to do today is head back to the base, throw all this stuff into storage, repair some tools, and we're going to come back out here. Um, maybe not necessarily to the Crackabook building, but we should probably check out that or that that off that big office building um, next door to it. Got to repair my tools, though. I'll see you guys at base. We'll catch up there. I almost forgot today was an airdrop, so I was running back to the town. Actually, I had forgot today was an airdrop. I was running back to town to go uh, start looting again, and there it is coming down. So uh, let's try and get that. I'm going to go ahead and drink a beer to get my stamina back. And we're going to go get this airdrop. Gosh, if I didn't have a broken leg, I could definitely get it. But <laughs> we'll try. we got to try. Hopefully there's an antibiotic in this thing. Man, I got like one or... I, I think I've got two more days until the uh, infection's going to kill me. So let me line my crosshairs up, take my hands off my mouse, and hopefully we can find this one. That's all I can do, man, is hope. And see, the smoke is staying up now that it's on the ground. See, in the last one, I swear the smoke didn't stay up. And this one was... Granted, this one seemed to drop a lot closer than the last couple ones, so maybe that has something to do with it if you're in range of it, that the smoke drops. But... I don't know. I never saw any smoke once it hit the ground in the last two airdrops, but we are going to get this one. Oh my gosh, fingers crossed for some good stuff in this one, right? Come on, come on. Good loot, good loot. Antibiotic, hopefully. No antibiotic. Damn. Oh wait, two! Haha! -ha! Never mind, what am I talking about? I was looking at the gun. <laughs> like, that's not an antibiotic. Never mind the other stuff in there. I was just caught on the, on the gun. The receiver actually, and I'm like, oh, that's not an antibiotic, but awesome. We got a rocket launcher schematic and an antibiotic, which I'm just gonna go ahead and take right now. And uh, yeah, cool, awesome. Now we don't have to worry about uh, dying from infection. Yay, <laughs> we're not gonna turn into a zombie, at least not today. All right, let's get back to town and continue looting. Then, oh, that's a good find. All right, we are back here in town. Let me sort my inventory here real quick. Um, I did bring a stone axe just in case, cause like a, our axe is all broke in the last the last time we were out here looting. So I brought a stone axe just in case, and I actually brought some forged metal to uh, repair our axes if they do break. I already looted that trash can. Uh, see, I've never even seen this building. This one's new. Some sort of trailer or something. Let's turn on our night vision to see inside of it. Oh, wow, that is a sturdy door. Oh, but there's a zombie going to help us break it, so... I'll let him do the, uh, the hard work here while I work, walk around and loot. See if there's anything worth looting. Yeah, leather sofa there. Leather, leather chair, I guess I should say. Anything else around here worth looting? No. that. Oh, it's part of the building. Oh, shit! What the? Lady! I missed! Oh! Where did she come from? There weren't any zombies out here. Are you gonna break out of this door or not, guy? Come on. I don't want to waste my pickaxe if you'll do all the work. There's another one. Oh, wrecked. Oh. Is there another door that I just don't see? No. What is that stuff right there? It says something on it. Like sandbags or something. You know what? I'm gonna skip this building because this. I, I got a feeling this is not gonna be worth looting because it's not gonna have anything good in it. Let me try one more time, real quick. 
Now that I know there's no more zombies around. Alright. Let's get in here and see what this zombie's so mad about. What are you protecting in here, zombie? What have you got? What's such a big... Oh my god, I missed it. Point blank range. <laughs> Hit him! Hit him in the first! Wreck him! There we go. Alright. Oh shit! Are you kidding me? <laughs> How was that zombie just sitting there? Oh, they still gotta work on this. The sleeper stuff is still not quite fixed. Uh, medicine cabinet on the ceiling. That's weird, but whatever. It was empty. Who cares? <laughs> That's where I like to keep my medicine cabinet. I put all my medicine cabinets on the ceiling, man. If you don't put your medicine cabinet on the ceiling, you just are not cool, man. I don't, I don't even know who, who doesn't do that nowadays. Like, everybody. That's like the hip place. That's all the hipsters do. They put their <laughs> medicine cabinets on the ceiling. Oh, there's a gun safe in here. Oh, so this was worthwhile breaking in here. I was just about to say, this wasn't even worth my time, but that's a gun safe. We'll break into it. All right, fingers crossed, here we go. Uh, what is that? Compound bow string. Cool, that'd be cool if we didn't already have one, but pretty neat find. Um, some pretty terrible stuff here, actually. I'm just gonna scrap these terrible pistol parts. That's a pretty good bar shotgun barrel. The rest of this stuff is like, mm, meh, meh, meh. I don't know. Uh, grab what I can. I'm gonna scrap the pistol barrel and take that shotgun part. I definitely want a shotgun and be able to build one as soon as possible. All right, well, that was that building. We did get a, a gun safe out of it, that's pretty good. Let's keep moving on and see what else we can find out here. Even though our inventory is kind of full, I'm gonna try and hit some of the regular houses today. Not like a big building, but just try and clear out some of the standard houses and stuff like that and get into these. Let's see, got a Sambo right there, going around the back. Not gonna worry about it then. Let's see, is there an easy way in? No. Let's break in the front door then. Let's see if we're gonna wake up any zombies. Doesn't look like it. Alright, check the corners. No zombies in this room. That's probably why we didn't wake any up, huh? <laughs> Ooh, purple clothes! Purple, purple, purple! Um. Is it worth taking, though? Hmm. First of all, I'm going to scrap this thing. Let me grab that and see if that's better than what I'm... Actually, I'm not wearing anything because all my stuff is, uh... Is, uh... I took it all off because I was overheating. So I'm just going to scrap that plant fiber shirt. And I'm going to wear the tank top. It looks cool, right? <laughs> um... At the risk of overheating, I'm just going to equip all my stuff again. Because um, for now, I've cooled off, so see if we can get anything else out of this place. No zombies in here so far. Maybe there's one back here in the back of the house. There might be a gun safe in this. This is a gun safe or a bathroom. Oh, there's a zombie. Hello, zombie. Oh, crap, two of them. Oh, I missed, 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 missed. She did not detect me. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. I hear it. I was going to say, I hear another one. Right, there she is. Wrecked! <laughs> None of them had any loot. Blech. Gotta get my, my looting skills up better. Ooh, was that a grill? That is a grill. Cooking grill. I've already got one, so I'm just going to scrap that and keep moving here. And lots of jars again today. I've got a bunch of them already, so I will be set on water. Oh, another Zambi. Saw her out of the corner of my eye there. Alright, gun in the toilet. No, I don't want any murky water. I don't want any turds. Just going to keep moving. There's an upstairs to this one. And there could be a gun safe downstairs. Ooh, ooh, lots of bullets. Okay, so eat that. 
and scrap those cans, take those bullets. Got a washing machine. Got a light there. Check out this desk. Mm, a leather duster, which would be good, except that it's really hot and it's a low level. Otherwise, I'd consider taking that. All right, see if there's a gun safe back here behind this. I don't know, should I turn the night vision goggles on? Yeah, it seems like I can see into the room better. Oh, look at that little zombie. Look at you just sitting there. Oh, I'm so peaceful. I'm resting so nicely. Die! <laughs> oh, she jumped up. Oh, crap! Oh, my God, it's the big one. Got her. Got her. <laughs> oh, I started bragging about killing the first zombie. Didn't see the other two in the corner. <laughs> oh, man, another gun. More bullets. Um, hmm, I got to drop something to get that. Let's scrap the wood, and let's see, what else can we do here? We could drink some water. I've got lots of jars. I may just drop all the jars. Mm, eat the yucca fruit. Let's try that. That probably is the easiest way to clear out an empty inventory slot like that. There we go. Love the guns in the toilet, man. Love that. Did I search the medicine cabinet? I did? Okay. One more here, and that's got metal on it, so we're going to use our pickaxe to break the metal. If there's any zombies in there, they are certainly awake at this point. And now switch to our regular axe to break through the door. And there is a gun safe. So Sweet! Let's make sure there's no zombies in here first. Nope, no zombies. Alright, let's crack another safe today. Getting lots of good gun saves today. All right, one more swing. Here we go. Fingers crossed for some good stuff. Uh, shotgun. Oh, we got a shotgun. Yes, it's a terrible sawed-off shotgun, but we still got a shotgun. Um, okay, so we got to figure inventory. One rock gone. Um, shotgun is now in my possession. Boom. It is on game. Um, I guess the jars can go right there. Let's see. I should probably break down this pistol and just scrap it entirely. Or, hmm, two dukes. You can't scrap the dukes anymore. Okay, you used to be able to scrap those into brass. I was going to say I could free up an inventory slot that way. Let's drink some water. Yeah, we'll drink all of our water, and that'll free up one inventory slot. And I definitely want this hunting rifle receiver. Are those both pistol parts? Nope, that's a hunting rifle. Okay, scrap. Let's see here. Let's figure this out real quick. We can do this. We can inventory manage this out. Um, free up a few slots, and let's disassemble this, because there is a good part in this pistol. Okay, so we want to keep... Let's see, assemble. We want to keep that pistol grip, and I'm just going to scrap the rest of it to save the inventory space. Let's see, scrap. And then I'm going to take that pistol receiver and see if I can build a slightly better pistol here. Where's my good one? Yeah, I take all my pistol parts and I should be able to build a slightly better one. If I take... Let's see, sort this stuff out here. <clears throat> take this one here and assemble it. Actually, let me take the this one first. Are there any good parts in it? They're all orange. Okay. This one has got yellow and green parts. Okay, so we can make, we can substitute parts to make a better one here. Let's think about this for a second. So the grip, our grip is better in this one. So this is pretty much our best pistol. We're just going to hang on to it. We're not going to disassemble it. We should take this one though and upgrade the grip in it and scrap that grip. See, like, do this, take this grip, and scrap it. And this receiver is slightly better than that one, so we'll scrap this one. And now, 
We saved a couple of inventory slots. We got those parts. Should be able to grab everything out of there. Cool, cool, cool. Um, what time is it? 714. It's starting to get dark, but we got time to maybe hit one more building. Oh wait, there's an upstairs to here. Oh crap, zombies, zombies, zombies. Are there any zombies up here? Haha, <laughs> luckily there's not. Alright, what do we get in the wooden chest? Epic loot nothingness! Um not gonna worry about scrapping that stuff down. I am going downstairs. I'm gonna try and hit one more building before it gets dark on us. Um Wait, trash. Search that. Anything good in there? Lead? Eh, I don't have the inventory space for that small amount of lead. Let's try the house across the street, and that's probably going to be... I don't have time for I don't know how big this building is. Oh, I wasn't crouching when I hit it. Are there any zombies in here? Hello, zombies. I'm here. Oop, backpack. Oh, purse. One of them. Whatever. One of them. Oh, and it was empty. Ooh. <laughs> Game, you, you hate me. Nightstand with some boots. The boots with the fur. <laughs> More lead. Eh, kind of makes me wish I'd have kept those other ones, but whatever. I can get lead pretty easily once we get underground and start mining. Let's check the medicine cabinet in here. Mmm, grain alcohol. Bandage I can make pretty easily, but grain alcohol. I should probably should probably get that one gunpowder. I'd rather have grain alcohol. Ooh, a turd in the toilet. Turds in the toilet. Nothing in there. Let's go upstairs and see if there is a I'm trying to think about the layout of this building. If it if there's Let's walk over here and see if there's a basement. If there's a basement, we'll check the basement because that has... Yeah, there should be a basement over here. If there is, it might have a gun safe, so we'll check it. No basement, so we'll go upstairs. There might be a gun safe upstairs. Ooh, another... A better hunting rifle receiver. Mmm. This is the type of stuff that bugs me. We got tons of paper at the house. Three sheets of paper is not going to make that big a deal. We got, like, jars... On jars, on jars. I hear a zombie like really close and it is getting late so we need to be quick about getting upstairs, looting it, and getting out of here. We have a horde. There is a wandering horde going by right now. You hear all the footsteps? Wow. See if there's a gun safe and we're just gonna have to run and get out of here. Hopefully we won't alert that horde. If we did, I was going to jump out a window. <laughs> My leg is healed, by the way, so I should be able to outrun them. I, at least until the horde starts running. we got about two hours left until the horde starts running. Be quick. No gun safe in here. There is a bookcase. What do we get? H stinking sheets of paper. Wow. Okay. Uh, anything else? One book bag? Fingers crossed for epicness. And a flashlight and a janky little pistol part. Um... A flashlight. We should probably take that, shouldn't we? Let's repair that pickaxe. Oh, that didn't use very much. Hmm. Alright, you know what? Plant fibers are gone. I can always get more plant fibers later. That is going to wrap up this episode, guys. I have got to run back to base before it gets dark on me. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the thumbs up button if you like this video. Guys, post me any comments or questions down below. We'll see you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching.